everyone. Uh, today, I'm going to tackle one of these junk drawers. Well, I've got some cupboards up here in my bedroom and I just want to get the junk drawers cleared so I can get them up for sale. So the one we're going to tackle first is this one. So this one. Um, I've got all sorts of stuff shoved in there and then God knows what in these drawers. Now, I did try to pull the drawers out so I could just empty them on my bed, but they won't come out. So we're going to have to just tip it all out by hand. So let's just get everything out and sort it out. Oh my gosh, it's all sorts of things. Oh God, the sticky stuff in here. Yuck. Yuck, yuck, yuck. Oh my days. Right, that's one. I'll be back with you in a minute. Got most of it out. Blech. Right, so <coughs> medicines. God, I seem to have a lot of medicines. But this, <coughs> now the reason I have lots of medicines is because they're so expensive in the UK um, and I buy one of these annual, uh, what do they call them, prepayment prescriptions um, and I pay that every year. So when it comes to order, I order everything that I need because at some point I won't want to pay for them. So I've got a few minutes. So I seem to have quite a collection of the aspirin inhalers. Right, what have we got in here? Oh gosh. Okay, this is a bit weird. Well, some people might find it weird. But wrapped up in tissue. I know what these are. These are my kids' teeth. Oh my god, they would think it was gross if they thought I still have these. I wonder if they want them back. Diddy little teeth. Does anyone else do weird things like that and keep all their kids' teeth and first lock of hair will be somewhere and pictures? And... Um, my son, I spoke to one of my sons yesterday, my younger one, and he asked me, do you have any pictures um, of when I was a baby? Gosh, she's getting sentimental. Um, and I'd packed them all. <laughs> so I said, well, we'll have to see. Right, let's get a bin bag ready to put most of this in. Oh dear. Oh, more medicine. A toothbrush holder. I must have millions of these. Oh, this must be what I'm using because it's got a toothbrush on it. So, right, we need that then. Um, some old... Oh. You know when you go on rides and they give you these sticks with your photos on. Hmm. I might have a look what's on them and I won't keep it. Adapters, a light for your phone. Oh, when I was trying to give up smoking. Oh my God, they're well out of date. Um, travel adapters, we always need those. More iPhone adapters. Hair stuff. Oh my God, I've got so much hair stuff. Styling gel. No, I don't use that. Sleep one's nearly empty. Got an old toothpaste. Oh, yay, yay. Hair slide. <laughs> I'm a bit of a snorer, so I have one of these, but I don't use it. You put them up your nose, it's supposed to stop you snoring. It doesn't work. Um, um, there you go. Right, so what else has been going on this week? Um, I need that. So I think last when I spoke to you, uh, I'd, I'd agreed that I would go meet the the by a halfway. I think that was, yes, Wednesday morning, even though it's taken the agent a week to get there. Um, and I haven't heard anything since. And I've chased the agent. I've even chased, got the lawyers to chase their lawyers and I've heard nothing. So I don't know what's going on and I'm trying not to get stressed about it. But um, so whether I've sold my house or not, I still don't know. Now I had a, a viewing on Friday 
Um, no feedback on that, Luther. What a surprise. I'm about giving up with my um, my estate agents. I really have. Um, a diving compass. That's my son. I'm going to put that in his box. <clears throat> so, for those of you that are new to my channel, um, then you'll know that I am um, selling my house and all my possessions to go travelling full time. And that's my retirement plan. So, in the last couple of months, we've been frantically clearing out cupboards and decluttering the house and selling on furniture. And, um, yeah, today it's, it's that awful time where you really do need to go through the junk drawers. I bet we've all got them. I've got many of them. So, we just have to get on with it. Um, I've managed to clear out a lot of uh, clothes. Been selling a lot on Vinti. It's gone quiet now, but I haven't really loaded anything new for a while. Um, I don't even know if that's the phone I use. I suppose I better check, am I? Uh, yeah, so it's just keep going. Now, even though I don't know whether I've got a sale coming up or not, <clears throat> you know, at some point I am going to sell the house, so it makes sense to get on with it. And I'm trying not to be depressed about all the hassles I'm having with this lady and my so-called estate agents. Gosh, I've got so many cables here. Okay, so that's the charge for my toothbrush, so we need that. Um, and some empty medicine. Oh my gosh. Ooh. Oh dear, I haven't used them for a while, I don't need them. I don't know what they're doing in there. Um, I don't even know what these are for. Do you find as well that you seem to, you know, you like me, you just seem to collect things and just don't throw things away. And and then you get yourself an order, I don't even know what that belongs to. Uh, oh, I don't know what that is. Maybe we'll find something. Ah, oh, that's the charger for my camera batteries. Oh, I've been looking for that every time I go on holiday. Uh, a scart lead. A scart to me. I don't need that. More charges. Look this. Oh, I think this. God, this is old. Uh, I think, as I remember, this was you plug this into a phone or. Um, music system and then you can have multiple headphones coming off it it's quite useful i think we brought this god ages ago it was i think it was when i was going to australia well about 10 years ago with my son and uh it was so we could watch the ipad films and listen to them at the same time it's quite useful i don't really have anyone to share it with now mm. nipple cream right why do I have nipple cream? <laughs> so, nipple cream is really good for moisturising your lips. So I put this on my lips every night. That's why I have nipple cream. It's a tip I learnt. And uh, it's a good one. And these are my charging cables. So, because I have... I have free phones. And I don't need free phones. But the problem is, I had it like a phone and then i used to get lots of people calling me like from the gym and stuff and so when i got a new phone i always get a new number um but then i still need the old number for the whatsapp and things and then it happened in the game in the next phone so i've got three phones uh it's mad i don't need free phones i need to do it one of them i do use when i go to antigua it's got an antigua sim in it but i don't really need all these phones but that's why i have these multiple chargers because it does two iphones one Galaxy, and on the other one does like the other one's actually quite handy. It does your cameras and things. Uh, yeah, I do use them. Um, no idea what that one's for. Must be for an iPhone or something. QC. Make it so small the writing you can't bloody read. Yikes! Yikes! Ouch. 
charges. Man. I don't know what that is, of course. Uh, charges, 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 charges. Nail files. Nail files are always handy. Never last very long, do they? Oh, actually, that wasn't too bad. But I've still got a drawer down here. So. Because there's some big stuff in here. So what we got in here? Um, oh, an old epilator. Well, I don't use that. Um, what is this? This is why it takes me so long to do. Oh, this is when well, my stickers to put my hair extensions in. Well, I don't wear those anymore. Let's get that bin bag down here. No, I don't wear my hair extensions anymore. Oh, all these false nails. I've got hundreds. Of, I've got blooming hundreds of these in here. I'm not going to use them, am I? Oh, a new mascara. Mood struck. 5D fiber lashes. A hair thingy. I don't know where the other end of that is. You know, one of those rare things to take care. More false nails. More false nails. More false nails. Get busy living. Yeah, I agree with that. Uh, Collagen things for your bags. I could probably do with that, can I? Bags under my eyes at the moment. There's loads of them in here. I must have bought those cheap. Uh, oh, eyeliner brushes. Somewhere I've got a makeup box of things to sell. More hair products. Flipping Nora. That sun cream must be out of date. I mean, I don't know if they go out of date or not, sun creams, but, oh. Oh, is that a date? I don't think that's a date. I don't know, but I'm sure somebody told me that they, they do after a bit. I don't know, do they go out of date? Let me know below, because that's a full bottle. Oh, I know. Oh, blimey, eh? Ugh. Upright spray, spray. Oh, root lifter. I do have to now. I just need root lifter. Oh, uh, moisture surge, surge for your face. Um, hair remover. Uh, oh, facial brush on hair. Oh, I didn't even know I had that. We always need that, but it's get older. Why is it as you get older, you get more? Um, facial hair. What is that about? More medicines. More creams that don't need. Uh, can't even read it. I don't know what it is. So, well, I'll start using. Fake eyelashes, don't use them. More nails. More eyelashes. Oh, God, something's sticky in here. Oh, no, it was a picture of me and James. Oh, it's ruined. I think I might have that digitally somewhere, thank goodness. Um, right, that's that drawer done. Honest to God, there's something with this bit of glass stuck to the bottom of this drawer. Oh my God, am I going to get that off? No, I have to soak it, oh my. Wow. Oh God. And then in here, what have we got in here? Mm. So, like beach scarves. Don't wear them. Uh, a pair of shorts. Loads of sun. Oh, these are all beach stuff. Oh my gosh. Oh my my body suit. I do wear these I do wear long sleeve sun suits. I mean I do like the sun but I don't like getting burnt. Um sports bra um thing. 
Oh, lots of lots of swimming stuff. Right, I'll sort those out. Half of it probably doesn't fit me, and then we can get that cupboard listed. Try and get that sold. Hmm. You probably noticed my energy levels seem quite low this weekend for me. I think this week, you know, well, just over a week now, has really taken it out of me emotionally, and uh, I'm very, very tired. And still don't really know what's going on, whether this lady's going to go ahead with the purchase or not. I just, I don't know what, I don't know if they're playing games with me, the agent's just been useless, I just don't know. And it's very infuriating. But I'm trying to stay calm and not give myself a flipping stroke or something. I just, uh, hmm. But I'm still carrying on with the decluttering, whatever hap is happening, because, you know, at some point I'm going to sell the house and the more we can get done, uh, the better. And we've been doing really well. So I'd say we've got rid of about 60% of the clothes now. We've certainly got rid of a lot of stuff out of the garage. And we can actually walk around the garage now. I mean, that's a novelty, isn't it? Uh, got rid of lots of cabinets downstairs. And all the cabinets from bedroom two and most of them from bedroom three and um, one from here. So there's not actually that much to get, you know, shot of now. Um, there's a couple of table, uh, like garden chairs and tables in the uh, garden. Well, the ones that are any good, my son's having them, the rest of them, they're no good for sale. So I need to at some point get them in my car and take them up the tip. And uh, I think when they, I think we get, I do think we're right, we're getting there. Because do you remember where we were? The how cluttered my house was, and I had all those pictures, everything all over the wall, and I had all my cabinets were covered in ornaments and everything. And yeah, I mean, I was not a minimalist. I can't believe I'm getting there. I mean, I do find the house very, very bare. I do miss my stuff already. <laughs> it's weird, isn't it? It's just stuff that you end up miss missing. And it's funny what you get attached to. But I do, you know, there's memory. But I mean, I say it's memories. I mean, I love having photos, right? And I know it's very old fashioned to have hundreds of photographs around the house. You know, not a lot of people do it nowadays, but I love having photos all around me. It just gives me, you know, it reminds me of happy days and. Just you know, like all stages of my son's lives and my grandparents and family and stuff, and I just love having them around me. And I'm actually going to miss having those around me when I'm um, moving around. When I go to Antigua, I've actually got quite a few that I took there last year and I left. So when I go there, at least I can put some pictures up again. But it's not an easy thing to carry around. So. You know, there's all my photos, there's all my ornaments. I mean, I haven't kept that much considering how much stuff I had. I'm not keeping that much. But um, there's some things I just don't want to get rid of because I can't replace them. I picked them up, you know, on my travels somewhere and uh, it's not like I can just go up the road and pick them up again. And I chose them for a reason and they're beautiful and I, I'm just not getting rid of them. At some point in the future, I will have a home again and I'll want them back. I guess it depends where my home ends up being because I'm going to have to ship them all somewhere, aren't I? Anyway, that's for another, that's another thing to worry about and another day in the future. Now let's concentrate on staying in the house and getting the hell out of Dodge. Is that actually a saying? Well, getting out of the UK. But yeah, I'm, I need to get out of the UK. I'm so fed up with it here. It's cold all the time. It's raining all the time at the moment. Oh, you get a bit of sun and then the next half hour it just rain, rain, rains. <laughs> if you don't live in the UK and you think we're exaggerating, we're not. <laughs> anyway, I hope your weather's much better than ours is. Yeah. Right, I suppose I better go and throw the rubbish away that we've just cleared out that cupboard. Get it listed. Uh, find a home for the things I haven't thrown away. Work out what all those ex uh, charges belong to and that, where I can't find what they belong to. Just throw them away. 
Yeah, I'm going to see a pair of slippers under another cupboard. I keep meaning to put them in the bin. <laughs> I better do that. Mm. But thank you for watching. Um, we're getting there. I'm trying to remain positive. Just got to think of the long, the long term. And, you know, once I get to my goal, how wonderful it's going to be. I'll see you all in the week. Take care.